Hello students, the question is a vessel of depth 2 h is half filled with a liquid of refractive index 2 root 2 and the upper half with another liquid of refractive index root 2. The liquids are immiscible. The apparent depth of the inner surface of the bottom of the vessel will be. The options are given. This question is taken from J.M.N. 2020, 9 January, first half. Now, to solve this question, we have to first analyze how to find apparent depth of liquid in a vessel. Suppose two liquids are there. Two liquids are there. This liquid has a depth of H2 and this liquid has a depth of H1. Refractive index of the bottom liquid is mu1 and refractive index of the top liquid is mu2. Okay, mu2. And this one is mu1. And suppose an object is placed here at the bottom of the container. Now we have to find the apparent depth of this object apparent depth of this object okay here refraction of light is occurring at plane surface and refraction of light occurs at this surface and this surface the eye is here now for refraction at plane surface of course at the interface between the two liquids now we know the formula the formula is apparent depth apparent depth by real depth equals to mu2 divided by mu1 okay now suppose this or uh, the image of this object due to refraction at the first interface is appearing here suppose here now the true depth here is h1 this is the real depth and the apparent depth is this suppose this is h1 dash okay so apparent depth is h1 dash divided by true depth h1 equals to equals to mu2 divided by mu1 so here mu2 is always remember first thing i have to analyze this formula again what is mu2 and what is mu1 first of all you have to understand this now the apparent mu2 is mu2 is the refractive index of the medium in which the i is situated the medium in which i is situated always remember and mu1 is the refractive index of the medium in which the object is situated that is mu1 is the refractive index of the medium from which light is coming and mu2 is the refractive index of the medium in which the light enters after refraction okay now see here mu2 what is mu2 the, the medium in which light enters after refraction which is mu2 so mu2 divided by mu1 is the refractive index of the object medium which is mu1 fine so h1 dash is h1 into mu2 divided by mu1 i hope you understand therefore for refraction at this level the image of this object will form here okay now coming to the second refraction for second refraction where now at the interface of air and this mu2 medium right 
in this case i will use again the same formula apparent depth by real depth in this case understand what is the real depth here the object is not this the object is this therefore the real depth will be this the entire length therefore the real depth is i do not know the apparent depth the real depth will be h2 plus h1 dash equals to mu2 i can say the refractive index of the medium in which lie i lies that is 1 divided by the refractive index from where the light is coming that is mu2 therefore the final apparent depth suppose that is h dash is h2 plus h1 dash divided by mu2 which is h2 by mu2 plus h1 dash by mu2 proceed to the next slide h dash is h2 by mu2 plus h1 dash by mu2 putting the value of h1 dash here h1 dash is h1 into mu2 by mu1 so h1 into mu2 by mu1 and mu2 mu2 cancels out therefore the final apparent depth of the image is nothing but h1 by mu1 plus h2 by mu2 and remember if there are several liquids like this mu1 mu2 mu3 h3 h2 h1 then also apparent depth is nothing but sum over of h by mu that is h1 by mu1 plus h2 by mu2 plus h3 by mu3 now coming to this problem a vessel of depth to h is half filled that is this is the vessel of filled with liquid of depth to h half filled half filled the refractive index of the medium in the lower portion is 2 root 2 and the upper portion is root 2 object is situated here so therefore the apparent depth apparent depth is nothing but h1 by mu1 plus h2 by mu2 h1 is h mu1 is root 2 h2 is also h mu2 is 2 root 2 which will give you as 3 by 2 that is 3 by 4 h root 2 so option b is correct thank you for watching this video please subscribe my channel faisalwar